morning, everybody. It's so great to see everyone across the globe here joining me in my filming studio in Jakarta. All right, everyone, we're going to start standing and then we're going to transition ourselves down to the floor. Yeah, um, just five minutes of standing work. So it's a hip focus, man. We're going to work this area, bring up, give this area a bit more love. So we are stronger in our pelvis, stronger in our lower abdominals and support our posture in a much stronger position. Okay, so standing in parallel position. Sandrine, bring your feet a little closer to each other. So approximately about a fist um, between your heels. If you look down, you kind of like put the fist between the heels, it's about there. So you want to align your heels to the center of your hip not to the outside of your pelvis there. Your toes will be pointing forward, growing tall, as tall as you can, right? Drawing up this abdominal, everybody. So we're not gonna hang like that. Oh, we're gonna slouch, please. Beautiful, my three trio in Spain, amazing. Take a deep breath. As we exhale, soften the knees. So we're gonna roll the spine down, starting from the head, the neck, the upper back. Keep your arms nice and loose, and take yourself all the way down to the floor where you feel comfortable. Bring the pelvis forward. Inhale at the bottom. As we exhale, we press the feet down to the ground as we lift the abdominal up, sending the tailbone under, bringing the pelvis upright, lower back upright, middle back upright, upper back upright, neck growing, head floating off your neck. Again, in breath as we lengthen through the spine. Exhale, we roll down, vertebrae by vertebrae. We're going into a deflection on each segment of the space of the vertebrae. And bring the pelvis forward as we fall through the hips. And soften the knees a little bit more. Inhale as we go down. Exhale as we roll it up again. Stacking up the spine like Jenga, like Lego. One block on top of the other. Lifting up tall and leg into the spine. This time we're going to go halfway. Roll down halfway through the spine here. As you breathe out. Now we bend the knees and send the pelvis back. Take your arms next to your ears to your little half squat. We stay here as we inhale, keeping the weight even spreading underneath the feet. Exhale, let me support our trunk by drawing the abdominal. Your arms stay long by the side of your ears. We start to create heat in our legs, heat in our feet. In through our backs, inhale as we lengthen and stay here. Exhale, we grind us up a little bit more, drawing our center nice and deep. Rotate to me, bring the arm across to the outside of the thigh and bring the top arm twisting up towards the sky. So we press down and we rotate. We stay, inhale, find more twist. Exhale. Drawing at center. Inhale, find more length and twist. Exhale, secure that center. And we come back, arms forward. And we rotate to the other side, arm across the outside. Rotate the trunk, bring the top arm to the sky. Beautiful. Can we sit down a little bit more, everybody? Can we lengthen through the spine and flatten up the back a little bit more? All right, chest, sternum, reaching away from the tailbone. Inhale, lengthen and twist. Exhale, drawing that center. Inhale, lengthen and twist. Exhale, and then we bring our arms back to our ears. Roll the spine down. Then we roll up through the spine, coming up to your standing position nice and tall. Okay, guys, stand in one second. Charlene, can we have you mute for me, darling? Thank you. All right. You're good, you're good. I've done it. I've done it. All right, nice and tall, right leg up. So plunge your left leg down, right knee up. Hug your thigh. Beautiful, you're gonna really ground your left foot down. Spine is still nice and tall, compress the thigh to your chest. 
Stay there, sit in breath. And then we open the thigh out to the side. Stay nice and tall. We're going to pull up that supporting leg. Pull up that pelvic floor. You can hold here, you can up to the side. Whatever we need to help you balance. And bring it forward and lower down. Other leg. We plant the right leg down. We take the left leg up. Find your balance. Wow, solid, everybody. Here we go. Hug the legs nice and tight as you grow tall to the sky and anchor the foot firmly down to the floor. And then we open your leg out to the side in external rotation. Still growing, lengthening, tall. Bring it back to the center and we release down. Externally rotate your hip joint. Open your feet slightly wider than your pelvis for your open V position. We're going to do some footwork here. We inhale, we go down. Yeah, that's it. And exhale, come back center. Inhale, we go down and the back stays straight. Exhale, return. Inhale, slide down the spine, stay long. Exhale, again. Inhale, exhale, come up. Two more. Inhale, nice and tall. Exhale. Last one. Inhale, down. Exhale, I like. One more time, down. And third leg counting. We stay there. Right heel up. Middle pulses. Exhale. Inhale. Pump. Exhale. One, two. Inhale. One, two. Exhale. Two more sets. Last set. Stay down, lower the heel, and the heel come up, and we go. Inhale, and two, in breath, and three, and four. Come up, Ben, and then last five. I'm watching you, my friend. And stay down, lower the heel. We're going to spin to your right. Knee down, arm forward. That's it. Bend the knee down. Swing it back, face me. Stay low. Other side, rotate and forward. That's it. And rotate back, face me again. And rotate down, arms forward. And back, stay low. Last one, rotation on green. Stay low, my friend. Down. And rotate back. And bring it up again. Okay. And take it down. Hands behind your head. Stay low. Side flexion to your right. And side flexion to your left. Exhale. And right. And and left. And up. One more each side. Down. Can we go down? Stay down. Last one. Come back up. Straighten. Ooh, that hit. Arms out to the side and down. Bring your feet a little closer. Rise up onto the ball of your feet. And we go. Down. Exhale. And two. Exhale. And three. And two more. And last one, we stay down and little pulses up and up and two, hold here and up and three, four, five and straighten and lower. We go down with the heel down, stay there. Cross the arm in front of you. Rotate to your right, pelvis stay center. Rotate to the left, and center. And to the right, and center. And spine to the left. Last set, spine to the right. Last one, and left. Come back, straighten the legs. Drop the arms, walk your feet back in and go to the front of your mat. Are they all hot at the moment? Excellent. Come down. All right. 
So here we go. Feet are parallel. Knees are pointing up to the sky. Hands underneath you. Spine is upright. We in breath, everybody. Exhale. Into your seat. We roll back. Get it. That sacrum to the floor. Lower spine to the floor. Arms straight to in breath. Exhale. Come up. Into that seat. Lifting tall through the spine. Exhale. We roll. We roll back. Get the sacrum, get the lower spine. Down to the floor, chest is open. Exhale, deepen the abdominal pull as we come up. And we lift through the spine. And last one, we round. We roll back. Sacrum, roll back. On the floor, now stay in that chest in position. Bring your feet closer towards your bottom. All right, ready for the pelvic crawl. Arms on by the side. Make sure that's in parallel. And lower the head and the chest down. And do a pelvic crawl. We in breath. Exhale. As we deepen into the abdominal, lengthen the spine down. And we peel the spine up to that bridging position. Now, taking care that you are using your hamstring and your abdominal and not the lower back to push up. Press the arms down a little bit more. Lift the pelvis a little higher. Inhale. Exhale, we roll down, melting the chest and lower ribs, lower back, sacrum, and the pelvis back to neutral. We go again, in breath. Exhale, deep, scoop in abdominal, then curl the pelvis, press the arm, press the feet, and lift through the hamstrings and the glutes. Inhale, press up a little higher, beautiful one, everybody. Exhale, lengthening the neck away from the shoulder as you melt the spine down. Printing every single bone down to the floor and come back to your starting position. Two more of this. In breath. Exhale, low back down. Curl the pelvis, press it up. Take it all the way up to the bridge. In breath. Exhale, we roll down again. Vertebra right by vertebra. Really enjoy this because this is our stretch for the lower back. It's like a little massage. Inhale, prepare again. Exhale, we roll it up, healing. One, four, at a time. Up to the bridge. Hold there, lift the pelvis a little higher. Flex, dorsiflex the feet. So toes come up, heels are done. Glutes are still pushing up. Hold the pelvis up. Lower the feet down into plantar, lift the heels up, all of the feet on the floor, lift the pelvis high, press the arms, and then hold the pelvis high, lower the heels, and flex the feet, heels down, toes up, hold the pelvis up, and lower the feet. Last one, lift the heels up, and lift the pelvis a little higher to the moment that they are screaming. They're shaking, they're burning. Hold that up there. Lower the heels down. Stay high the pelvis. In breath. Exhale, we roll down. One bone at a time. And release the pelvis at and extend the leg away from me. Stretch it down on the floor. Dorsiflex the foot. Your pelvis should feel even. And then bring it back. And again. Reach down as you inhale, scooping up the abdominal. Exhale, bring it back. Inhale, reach the heel away. And then exhale, coming back. If you're not sure what your pelvis is even, bring the heel up apart on your hip joint. You can feel whether the pelvis can stabilize itself as you slide the leg out and in. One more time. And out. And pull it. Now continue again, extend out as you inhale, point that foot, bring it up, lift, bend through the knee, lower the foot, slide away, and kick, fall through the knee, lower the foot, and slide away, and kick, and fall through the knee, lower the foot, and slide away, again, and bend, and slide down, last one, up, and bend, 
and just lower the foot down. We've got the other leg, please. We slide out. Reach out as you inhale. Pelvis is stable. Exhale, come back. Again. Inhale, reach away. Exhale, come back. You can have the heel of the palm on the hip bone if you want to, as a little tactile cue. And come back in. Two more. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Two more. Inhale, reach. Exhale. And then reach out again. We kick it up. Up. We bend the knee, lower the foot. We slide and kick it up. Bend and lower. We slide and kick up. Bend and lower. Two more. Slide. Pelvis is stable. Remind yourself that. Down. Last one. Up. We bend. Lower. Now we stay. We do not articulate the pelvis. We just lift the pelvis up. The spine is straight, approximately about a fist underneath the pelvis. Now hold the pelvis stable. Extend the leg away from me down on the floor. We then lowering the pelvis and come back. And then again, straighten the leg away from me like we did before with the pelvis up and bring it in. And again, reach out three more. The pelvis doesn't move and bring it in. And two more. So we're really working on the hip extensors here, your hamstrings and your glutes. And last one. And bring it in. Stay there. Lift the leg up to tabletop. Pelvis is still up. We step for five, four, three, two, one. We lower the foot down. We establish a pelvis position. Let's go the other leg. Slide away with a dropping. And bring it in. We're just changing leg now. A slide up. And then bring The pelvis is still higher. We haven't dropped yet. And slide up. And bring it in. And slide up. And bring it in. Last one. Slide up. That's it. And bring it in. We stay. Lift the leg up to the tabletop position. We step up there for five, four, three. Two, one, we lower the foot down, establish a balanced pelvis, we lower the pelvis down. We circle the legs, not the legs, the arms, interlace the hands, underneath your head for the chest lift. Firmly place the feet down to the floor and think about dragging, the sensation of dragging your feet towards your pelvis, without moving the pelvis, without moving the feet as well. Just drag it. Now from here, deep in the abdominal, as we lift the chest up to a chest lift position, we lay the lower back down to the floor with the abdominal, stretch your arms forward behind your thigh, and lift up a little higher. Hold that knee high, hands behind your head. Come on down, again. Exhale, lift, arms forward. Lift up a little higher. Hold that knee height. Back. And return. Again. Lift. Arms forward. Lift up a little higher. That's it. Arms back. And return. We've got two more of this. And lift. Arms forward. What are your feet doing, guys? And you should have still firmly place that on the floor. Arms back. And return. Next one, we stay up. Exhale. We'll lift. Take the arms forward again. Lift up a little higher. Hold that new height. Arms are forward next to each other. Rotate to me at chest lift rotation. Come back to center. Other side. Lift the chest high. And forward and up. And center. Rotate forward and up higher. And center. Watch the pelvis. Make sure the pelvis stays stable in the middle. And lift. And center. And lift. And center. And lift. And center. One more each side lift. Center. Last one lift. And center, hold, hands behind your head, 
come on down. All right, walk your feet to the side of the mat, so feet a little bit wider. All right, open your arms up to a T position, drop your legs to me. For some hip rolls here, bring it back to the middle. Over to the other side. So you stand to squat wide, come back to center, that's it. And then other way, twist. Inhale, come back to center. And then other way, twist. Dropping, thank you. And center. Last set, anchor your shoulders down, just work through the hip joint. And center. Last one down. And come back to center. Walk your feet closer to each other, or in fact together. Lift them up to tabletop. Spine twist supine, from the waist level, rotate to me as we in-breath. And then come back, center. Inhale to you as we rotate, anchor the shoulder. Exhale, come back. Make sure that your legs travel together as one unit, over to me, please. Exhale, over to you. Exhale, one more each side, to me. Exhale, back to center. Last one to you. Exhale, come back to center. Lower the leg away from me, down to the floor. Straighten it down to the floor. Extend the other leg up to the sky. Flex the foot for your leg circle across the body and down as we inhale, parallel. Exhale, and in breath. And exhale. Last set, in breath. And then exhale, we stay other way, out and down. Exhale, stay parallel, in breath. Exhale, last set, in breath. Exhale, stay, we point the foot, bend the knee, lower the foot, bring the other one in first. Straighten the first one down to the floor and take the other one up to tabletop and straight leg up, dorsiflex, let's go across the body, inhale. And exhale, and in breath. And exhale, last set, in breath. And exhale, stay, reverse, in. And out, in breath. And out, and in breath. And exhale, stay, hold, we point, bend the knee, take the foot down. Now, bring the other one in into bend position. Walk your feet a little bit further away here, so your knee angles quite large. Take your arms overhead. We're going to do our roll up with a bent knee position. Inhale to lift the chest up. Exhale as we lift up to that C curve. Thank you. Now here, lift the back, open the knee, slice the arm out to a T position, and give you a slight higher release. Extension in the upper back. Then we close the leg, arms forward, back to your C curve. You roll down. You can use the back of your thigh if you need support here. And arms overhead. Again, inhale, look. You can grab the back of your thigh if you need to. Exhale, peel off the floor to that C curve. Lift the spine tall, open the knees. Slice the arm out, chest up to the sky, and forward, C curve, roll back, that's it, and arms over it, again, inhale, lift, exhale, peel the spine up, inhale, open the arms, lift the chest, high release, slice. Beautiful, guys. And come back, C curve. And we roll back. Arms overhead. Last one here, everybody. Inhale, chest lift. Exhale, peel up to that C curve. Open the arms, lift the back. Come back to upright. Take your arms forward here. Let's go to our spine stretch. So hold that, hold that. Can we get the spine taller here, everybody? Imagine you have a ruler in your spinal column. I want that spine to be as long as a ruler. Then, spine stretch forward. As we exhale, we roll forward and down. 
Keep the knees bent here. Inhale. Can we go deeper into the back in flexion? Exhale. We roll up. Come up. Sitting up nice and tall. Again. Exhale. We peel the spine off against the imaginary wall behind you as you roll forward and down. Inhale. Find more length and find more flexion in the hip. Exhale. We peel back up against the imaginary wall and we grow even taller. Two more times. Exhale. Roll forward and down. That's it. Inhale. Roll longer and deeper today. Exhale. Roll it up. Create more space in between each vertebra. Nice and tall here. One more time, everybody. Roll down and forward. Yeah. Moi, moi, moi. Beautiful. In breath. Exhale. Roll back up. And lift tall. Interlace the hands in the back of your head. Double exhale. Shh, shh. Rotate to me. Inhale. Center. Double exhale to you. Shh, shh. Inhale. Center. And imagine that roller still staying in the spine here. So we do not want to break the roller. Shh. But we're just going to rotate in the axis of the spine. And rotate. Shh. Sit right on the city bone and rotate. Shh, shh. Tall as you return. Last set. And twist. Shh, shh. Inhale, grow more. And twist. Shh, shh. Inhale, grow more. Now here, rotate to me. Shh. Just one exhalation. Now side flexion, elbow to the knee. Exhale. Shh. Come back. Inhale, center. Rotate. Shh. Elbow. Same elbow side to the knee, side flexion, beautiful. And come back and rotate to the center. Rotate to me, elbow to the knee. And lift, tall and center. Rotate, shh. elbow, same elbow side to the knee. Come back, tall and in center. So don't go across, guys. You just go the same side. You don't want to go across to the other side. Last set. Rotate to me. So my left elbow to the left knee. And come back. And center. Rotating. My right elbow to the right knee. Right elbow, right knee. Come back. Center. And there we go. Knees together. Please grab the shin. Pull the leg to you. Rolling like a ball position. So balance on that triangle point between the city bone and your tailbone. Lift the toes up. Use the spicer. Grow tall in the neck. Round the spine. Here we go. Inhale. We roll to the shoulder. Exhale. We find our balance. Lock those arms, guys. Inhale. Do not let your leg fling away. Exhale. Come back. Inhale. Imagine you have a ball behind your leg. Squeeze that ball. Again. Three more. In breath. Exhale. Yeah, two more. In breath. Exhale. Last one. In breath. Exhale. Balance. Balance. Hold up. Bring the hands closer towards the knee. Right? We press the knee against the hand. We roll the spine back. Roll back, articulating slowly down, down to a single leg stretch position. One leg extend out, hold the other with the hands. Can we lift the chest a little higher? There we go. That's more like it. And we switch. Exhale. Legs in the same part. Exhale. Shh. And out. Shh. And out. Shh. And out. Shh. Four more sets. Shh. Shh. Three more. Shh. Shh. Two. Shh. Shh. Last. Come back with hold, hold that position, lift the leg up. Exhale down, Shh. lift the leg up. Beautiful, exhale down, lift the leg up. Exhale down, last one. Exhale down, bring it up the same height, bend the knees, switch leg. Lift the leg up, exhale down. 
Lift the leg up. Keep the shoulders away from your ears, please. And down. Lift the leg up. That's it. Exhale, down. Two more. Exhale, reach. Last one. Exhale, reach. Bring it up the same height. Bring the knees in. Interlace your hands behind your head. Rotate the chest to me. Opposite leg down for leg changes with rotation. And twist. And twist. And twist. Twist. Move the legs from the hip joint, not from the knee. The angle of the knee stay constant all the time. And rotate. And rotate. And rotate. One more set. And come back facing me. Step. Wrap the hand to the back of your thigh. Can we lift the chest a little higher? Use your arm here. Get both shoulder blades off the floor. Deepen up the abdominal to lay the lower back down to the floor. Stay for three, two, one. Hold that knee high. Hands behind the head. Rotate to the other side. Switch the weight. Grab the back of your thigh. Lift up higher. That's it. Can we lift up higher? Give me more flexion and rotate forward. Stay for three, two, one. Hold that new height. Heads behind. Come back to center. Legs up the tabletop. Lower the chest down. Lower both feet down. Slide the legs long. And we're going to take the body to me for our side lift. Well done, everybody. Okay. Legs are long. Top hand down the floor. I want to see a gap underneath the waistline. We lift. We'll lower off the floor. We'll lift. Inhale, hover off the floor. And lift. And lower. Two more. And lower. Last one. And just hover. Separate the leg. Top leg goes back. Bottom leg goes forward for season. Inhale. That's it. Last set. And bring the top leg to the back. And we lift up higher. And lower. Hold the floor. And lift. And lower. And lift. And lower. And lift. And lower. Two more. Lift. And lower. Last one. Lift. Hold it up there for five. Four. Beautiful. Three. Higher. Higher. One. That's it. And come on back. Legs together. Lower down. Bend the bottom knee in front of you. Top hand pushing the hip away. And then relax the foot. And top leg lift. Eight. And seven. Six. Five. Four. I want to see the waist lifting up the floor. Two. That's it. One. Stay. We bring the leg forward. We take it up. Down and then back. So hip flexion. A B duction up. Lower and back. And two. Inhale. And four. Five, your spine still straight, moving from the hip joint. Last one. Now we bring the leg forward again. We're gonna drop it down. Exhale for five. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, five, four, three, two, one. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And again. Last set. And lift up. Bring it back. And take it down. Good job. Bend the knee. Push yourself up. 
Coming up. Excellent. Yeah, I know. You can kick your bottom. Yes, you can. <laughs> yes, you can kick your bottom. Arms are to the side. We've got more bottom anyway. So I want you to sit as tall as a mermaid. This is a mermaid series. And lateral stretch. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. All right. And come back up. And let's transfer ourselves down to the floor. Bring your hand, stack that one top of the other, diamond press position. I got my right hand on top of my left hand here. Leg nice and long. Covering your head off your arm. Line the shoulder blades down. Pick up the abdominal, reach the leg long, and then lift the upper spine. Up to extension. The gaze is still down to the floor. Your neck is long. And come back down. Inhale. Lengthening forward and up. Exhale. One more last so. Inhale. So you really want to tap into your mid trapezius muscle to come up here. Beautiful, guys. And coming down. Now here, keep your right hand sticking to your forehead. Lift the right arm up and lift the left leg up. Two of the modified swimming and coming back. So opposite arm and leg. So keep the hands the same. Right hand to your forehead as you lift up your extension, left leg up. That's it. And coming down. Again. Inhale now. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. Left leg, right arm up. And down. Last one. Inhale. Left leg, right arm up, and come down. Switch your hands, left hand to the forehead, and lifting the left arm with the back, right leg up too, and down. Inhale, reaching, lifting up. That's it, everybody, and come down. And inhale, lifting up. Exhale. Two more, lifting up, exhale, last one, and lift, exhale, come down, bring the legs together, take your hands, interlace in the small of the back, head towards me for the double leg kick, please, lift both legs up, we kick, three, two, one, inhale, stretch the arm, Stretch the leg long, long back. Head over to the other side, and we go again. Exhale, kick. Two, one. Inhale, reach, lift, lift. Head to me. Exhale, three, two, one. Inhale, lengthen and reach out. That's it. Head to the other side, kicking one. Inhale, and turn to me. Exhale. Inhale, and turn to me, last one here, inhale, reach, long, and stay, bend the knees, grab the ankles, guess what, yeah, let's go rocking prep, lower the chest down, all right, we go, bring the pivot point down to the floor, lift the thigh, lift the back, lift the knees up higher, Exhale, come on down. And we go again. Inhale. And hip extension, back extension. Then knee extension. Everything comes up, everybody. And come on down. Two more times. In breath. Lifting the back. Lifting the legs. Lifting the knees. And come on down. Last one. In breath. And back, legs, knees are higher, neck is long, and come on down, beautiful work. Release the legs, pull them to the side of the shoulder, push the floor away, round your back, to your rest position. Gorgeous, take an in breath, exhale, tuck your toes under, please come up into your up stretch position. Now we're facing down. Exactly. Catch between your arms. Lift the heels up. 
Send the pelvis long. Lower the heels down. Full little cow stretch. That's it. All right. Step your right foot to the outside of the right arm. Right foot outside of the right arm. Back leg is long. You got it? We're like this. Yeah? And then, right hand pushing the right thigh away. Out. That's it. Lift through the spine. You can go into slight extension here if you want to. And reach up. That's it. And release the knee. Take the arm up. Rotate up to the sky. Exactly. Gorgeous. Bring the arm down. Elbow to the ground. To the ground. And stay long to the back leg. And stay long and flat in the spine if you can. All right. And bring your hand back. Push. Push. Stack the right foot back. Up stretch. And left foot to the left, outside the left hand. Good job. Stay in the lunge. Left hand to the left, in the thigh. Push the thigh away. Arch up if that's available for you. Try to keep the back leg planted and long, everybody. Use that quad. Oh, beautiful. Arch up. Just like the contemporary dancer, everybody. Beautiful. And come back, release that arm up to the sky. Find that twist. Gorgeous. Really work the back leg, everybody. Use your quad. Use your back extension straight to the spine. Nice. Bring it down. Elbow to the floor. Elbow to the floor. Spine is long, though. Don't run the spine if you can. All right, stay long. Good work. And then come back up, hand, hand. Step the foot back, up stretch. High pelvis and crunch the feet. Lower one heel, bend the other knee. And we'll switch, and we'll switch, and we'll switch, and we'll switch. One more each side, and we'll switch. Both heels high and both heels down. Walk your feet towards your hands. And then, not yet, don't roll up yet. Walk your feet to the outside of the mat. Then, exhale, rotate your legs. Sit down into a deep squat. I'm quite wide, not so. And then, come back into a little squat. Oh yeah, that's it. And we're gonna just sway to one side. And a sway to the other side. This is gonna be amazing if you're traveling to Asia and you end up with a squat toilet. I'm telling you, <laughs> it's a handy skill. <laughs> oh Morocco, I've done it. And again, reach. And again, one more each side. How low can you go? And other one. Come back to the center. Yes, Bernadette, we're following you. Press your hands. Another you go up. Step, oh, lift the pelvis up. Walk your feet to a parallel position. And then soften into the knees, soften into the pelvis and roll the spine up to your standing position. Inhale as we lengthen the spine and we grow even taller. Exhale, we roll down one more time through the spine, falling through the hips. Can we fall a little deeper and go closer to the floor? And in breath, exhale, soften through the knees and pull the pelvis to roll up and up and up and taller. As we inhale, Create lightness through our body, lightness in the spine, and we feel like we're going to float off to the universe, the galaxy. Exhale, the gravity pull us down again. One more breath in as we go. Light, lengthening. 
exhale, we ground ourselves down. Bring hands to the center of your heart, palms together. Take an in breath together with me. Exhale. And thank you very much for moving with me today on a beautiful Sunday. Terima kasih. Thank you, everybody. That was fantastic. Um, I hope your hips enjoy that class today. Thank you for watching and completing the class. I'm Mira and I'm here to help you to love, look and feel your absolute best through Pilates. If you enjoyed this video, you will love my 7 day beginner challenge. Click the first link in the comment below and sign up. You will receive daily workout videos focused on building a sustainable practice in as little as 15 minutes per day. This is for all levels as everyone can gain a deeper understanding of the Pilates fundamentals. If you enjoy my work, please like, comment and subscribe and turn on notification so you do not miss any of my free classes and programs. See you on the mat tomorrow.